most people should say cooler bear blessings so much. Just all the locals have the most secure hand and meditation they have so they can eat, stay down, and start getting blood and more in their head feathers. On our level, we have these brown animals with white teeth, long ears. These are Sommerines gazelle and low from Africa. That's the long ears yeah. give, give them a really good sense of hearing. And if you want to experience what it's like to hear like an antelope, just put your cupped hands behind your ears and suddenly you notice that I sound a lot louder. And of course, one thing they use they're really good hearing for is to detect danger approaching, such as uh, their main predator, the cheetah. Now, the sovereign gazelles here are not as fast as cheetahs, but they are more maneuverable than them and they have more endurance than cheetahs do. So their strategy to get away from cheetahs is to outmaneuver them. They start their light brown youngsters, dark brown adults, and start South African stable antelope. And look closely at the horns, at the horns of the adult stable, you notice that they all are pretty much the same size. That is because with stables in Africa, there is often not a lot of people to go around. So the female stables need the same size, but the male antelope has a range of so. Yeah, they're all looking in different directions. So they should be doing that because they just don't like each other and raise their hands. Okay, they should be doing that because they're looking around for danger for each other and raise their hands. Yeah, and danger for each other. Thank you. 
born with an African corn tree traveled a long time to clean those corn trees, grab the leaves, and pull them back in their mouth. And if it grabs until it gets a bonus out, they have very thick flies that help get rid of the corn. Down the gully, that first tree comes with another coral tree, but you notice on that tree, all the leaves end at the same height above the ground. And what do you think after that tree? Uh, earlier we saw the farmers' uh, gazelle. We have a close relative farmers' gazelle on our left side. The small tan South African spring black antelope with the black stripe on our side. And the black stripe helps make themselves look bigger and more impressive when they have the hierarchy in their herd. And mixed in with the uh, spring. So here's the F fawn, the right of mom right there. And they're called mule because they have big ears like mules too, which helps them to take These are East African crown cranes. Yellow up there at their head, which is where the crowns are named. Uh, show off each other, kind of like their fancy hat. And cranes do courtship with each other every day to maintain the pyramid. Look closely, you can see some of the cranes are paired up with the made of pyramids hanging out with each other. So back there, we saw the Maasai. Sorry, back there, we saw the uh, grass the other canyon. Up there on our right side is and these grass are born about six feet tall. They have to be that tall, they're born. So the hard fall, they kind of come out front legs first and they kind of lose down on the ground from mom. But that fall does have the advantage of breaking the umbilical cord and the grass grabs start breathing on its own. And we have two more coming around the head of us. Another mom and her young calf on the right side. The big grand was here.
bata kasi. Pwede na ulit yung ano, o. Yung balon. Nakalain mo yung stroller ng kabudok. Ano? This one is 1988. 